You talk about saturation. What's your approach with saturation and in, in, in mastering? It depends what I'm saturating. So like sometimes I'll saturate low end with like one particular plugin or like I'll try to saturate the sides, you know, with the, the tube gear. Or sometimes like I'll try to drive the entire signal with like that newfangled saturate plug-in but it just depends it depends on what i'm going for and like what i can get away with like sometimes when i have a really really dynamic mix with a lot of really loud elements and a lot of really quiet elements i'll reach for saturation more and more to like drive the signal so that it gets more constant and more present because there's no amount of limiting that's gonna make the vocals sound more present like i need to be able to like kind of drive stuff 